Well, this is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is back in a big spot here tonight. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed. It was the charisma. It was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's going to look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes, would make yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. All right, so here he is, one of the more prolific takedown artists in the UFC at present. And when you get some praise from Daniel Cormier, when it comes to your offensive takedown game, you know you're doing something right. And we talk about wrestlers and judo players and grapplers, but this guy just combines all of that. He is able to use foot sweeps from the grappling game. He is able to use throws from judo, and he's able to use wrestling in the, from the wrestling game to take people down. He has an array of takedowns at his disposal, and he uses every single one of them from the speed of the level change to the timing to the knowledge of where to go next when the guy starts to defend he's truly truly something special i don't think he could take you down but tonight he doesn't have to so he does not in have this to. matchup prevailing wisdom is he'll be able to get this fight to the canvas our tale of the day for this our main event of the evening both fighters are 31 with the same height and some differences in reach all right, now for the official introductions, we go inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out O2 Arena in London, England, it's time! Five rounds in the UFC featherweight division. It's who he first? Fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee! And now we're producing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 140 pounds. Assassin! All right, grip the rules of the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. I want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, so back your corners, my favorite. as this fight gets underway. And it's going to be interesting to see how this matchup plays out. Definite striker on one side against the other guy who's more really well. And in those situations, normally the guy that's more well-rounded will be the one that will find success. I want to see how this plays out. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this guy. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Beautiful body kick lands right under the elbow. Whips on the straight right hand. Nice kick there. Whoa! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Three minutes to go. 
Well done to catch the kick. We'll see what he can do. Straight punch lands. Oh, he lands a huge knee to the body. That's a crippling oh. shot there. Wow! with conviction now. Just over two minutes to go in what has been a furious round one. Oh man, how is he standing? Brutal knee to the body. Not there. He has a commitment to kick it tonight and it shows. strike that was. What a strike that he is landing over and over again. His opponent will need to make some adjustments. <laughs> Big ball from punch land. Now he gets back to range. Real nice body kick land. 30 seconds now to go in the opening round. Fifteen seconds remain in the round. Come on, let's get back in this fight. Oh, clipped him with the overhand. Oh, round two is next. Mm -hmm. Let's check out some of the action now from that previous round, and he really kept finding a home for those kicks. Yeah, and why would you change it? If your opponent is not going to check, if he's gonna stand there, and he's not on his toes, and he's stationary, you keep driving those kicks into his thighs, into his body, until he makes some sort of adjustment. All right, next round is underway, DC. We talked about his powerful kicks, how he attacks all go, sides guys, of the body, the head, the legs. Pretty good start for that. That was so impressive to see. Someone fight almost predominantly with their legs and have that level of success. Lee's head kick is blocked. No damage there. And he connects there with a punch, so pretty good striking display by him this one. He throws everything so straight and so accurate. Oh, nice jab. I mean, look at the commitment to kick in this fight. All right, so he's landed some good shots. You hate to be overly critical, but nothing really in terms of combinations tonight. Well, the jab has been looking great. But how about jab, jab, right hand? Right. Because eventually you're going to have to put something on your opponent that's going to really make him pause. I believe the jab has been working so well, if he drops a big right hand after it, he may be able to finish his fight. Nice punch lands. Lee gets touched by that kick to the body. Unable to connect with the right hook. I mean, he's cutting him down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. That punch to the body does a lot of damage. Some real power shots here. It's such a fast leg kick. Oh, wow. Huge head kick. Boom. Big jab. Oh, big left hook there. Oh. Right, he engages in the single collar tie. Lee's got the tie clinch now. Whoa! He didn't even see coming. It landed flush, and the rest, as they say, is history. Big knockout win for him here tonight. 